you asked a lot of questions when we picked up the camper van? Not just about the vehicle, but on recommendations on where to go and what to see. Use maps and guidebooks to help with planning, picking drive routes and times. Don't underestimate some of the drive times. So make sure you give yourself plenty of time between locations. Drive to the conditions and perhaps avoid driving at dusk and dawn. Remember to drive on the left hand side of the road. We haven't found driving the camper van too difficult. We familiarised ourselves with the road rules and we're aware that we're double the height and width of most cars. We did look out for overhanging branches and to be careful when we're reversing. When planning your itinerary, it pays to pre-book your campground accommodations, especially in peak seasons. There are so many holiday parks and camping grounds you can stay at. We've met so many other travellers and have even changed our plans based on their recommendations. We love the outdoors and nature and have really enjoyed exploring some of the national parks. You could even camp in some of the parks and the views we've been waking up to have been breathtaking. It's great to have the flexibility to pick and choose where we want to go at our own pace. Think about doing a, a big food shop in a major city to save you money when you're doing a longer road trip. We've loved cooking our kitchen. There are plenty of utensils and all the equipment we need to get a little bit creative. Look out for information centres. They offer free advice on what to do and see locally. We pre-booked some of the must-go experiences to avoid disappointment. We only planned a couple of days in advance.